Fire rate mechanic here again, and we got this BMW in here for a check engine light. And we got a couple codes. We got a P0491 and a P0492 BMW secondary air injection. So we got some kind of air injection problem as far as the flow goes, and I uh, just wanted to go over what we found when we were diagnosing this. Uh, basically, the first thing we did, we pulled out the, this is the actual air injection pump itself. Um, we just disconnected it, applied, applied power and ground here. Pump seemed to be working fine. So what we went ahead and did is, um, if you look down here, the air pump, this usually is gonna mount right over here like this. Um, we pulled this up so we could get to the diverter valve here. Um, the diverter valve is controlled by vacuum and this vacuum line goes to a vacuum, electronic vacuum switch which is located down behind the intake here. So um, we tried activating this with a scan tool. We weren't getting any airflow. We did verify we weren't getting any airflow. The air pump's coming on. So all that stuff's good. Um, what we found is we got a, there's actually, a, if you follow this vacuum line down behind the intake, you got a check valve here. And the vacuum hole was actually, actually broken off. So the vacuum switching valve wasn't supplying power or wasn't, wasn't, applying vacuum to the diverter valve. So let me see if uh, I can actually see back. Yeah, I don't think you guys are gonna be able to see that. But the vacuum switching valve is right behind here and it connects to a port in the back of the intake manifold. So ultimately, um, what's gonna fix this one is just repairing, as simple as repairing, you know, this uh, rotted out vacuum line. So we'll fix that, verify the repair, and hopefully this BMW will be good to go. Thanks for watching. If it's helpful, be sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to the Flat Rate Mechanic.